Okay, now we're going to go over how to format your external hard drive. So if you have a thumb drive or, you know, your external hard drive, your new system, I'm going to recommend that you format it um, for the Macintosh operating system, especially if you have a PC um, and you're going to be going back and forth between the PC and the Mac. Um, I think it's uh, pretty important to do this. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to insert my external media. That could be a hard drive or a thumb drive. Um, and it's going to go ahead and um, pop up here in the finder. Now, uh, there's a couple ways uh, that you can do this, but the way I want you to do it is I want you to use this program called the Disk Utility, and you can see it's down here in my dock. It's a hard drive with a stethoscope. To get to that, I'm going to go to Go. I'm going to go down to this Utilities folder, which is in, inside the Applications folder, so you can see that it is Inside Applications, Utility. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to double-click Disk Utility. Now, I make sure that I've got all my external media, anything that I'm in love with, all of my backup stuff, that is all disconnected from my computer so that I do not accidentally erase this. And so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to select this generic USB disk. And you can see that it's currently formatted for an MS-DOS uh, FAT32. That's a PC uh, file format, and it sort of caps out at 4 gigabytes of data transfer, which I don't love. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click this Erase tab, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to call this 2019 Schmitz. Um, I'm going to call this 2019 Travel. Okay. And then I'm going to switch the formatting from Mac OS X, uh, or excuse me, MS DOS FAT32 to whatever I need. And I just want to show you over here that if you are working uh, exclusively on a Mac, I want you to sort of select Mac OS Extended Journal. So I want you to select this Mac OS Extended Journal. And if you are going to be traveling back and forth on a Mac and a PC, I want you to select this XFAT, um, which is basically an updated version of FAT32. And this will play nice on both the Mac and the PC. Um, I'm going to be traveling between two things, so I'm going to select XFAT. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and hit the Erase tab. And that's going to erase all of the data on the drive and then format it for uh, the file system that I need. And it's going to rename it. Now you want to make sure that you have nothing on this drive that you need. Um, once that is done, you now have a formatted uh, XFAT drive that you can work back and forth on a Mac and PC. Again, if you're going to do this uh, Mac only, all you have to do is say erase. Uh, I can just switch the formatting, um, and then I can erase it. Now again, uh, you only want to do this one time when you set up your hard drive when you have nothing on it. So I do this always when I first get a new uh, external hard drive. Okay.